Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys some of the things that I've purchased for postpartum after I have this little guy. Um, if you guys saw my last video, then you know that I'm very, very pregnant. I'm officially 40 weeks and 5 days and I'm just now sitting down making this video. So that tells you a little bit about my current situation. Um, I'm struggling to make it through the day, but tomorrow's my induction day if this little guy doesn't come out today. So, I figured it's no time like the present to share this with you guys in case life is super hectic, which it usually is when you have a new baby, um, and then I don't have any time to sit down and make this video whatsoever. So, let's hop in and I'm going to share with you guys some of the things that I have gotten to prepare. So, with all of my other pregnancies, usually I didn't really um, invest in getting items for postpartum healing mostly because I felt like whatever the hospital gives me I'll just use that and once I'm out I'll survive but this time around um, since my last pregnancy was only 18 months ago um, since I gave birth I remember everything very vividly and all the things that I wish I had and I want to be prepared this time around. One of the first things I purchased was the Tux medicated cooling pads. These are medicated cooling pads um, with the witch hazel. So it's supposed to help with things like hemorrhoids or any like irritation um, at the hospital when I had the girls and miles actually. The hospital did give me witch hazel pads. Um, usually sometimes they give you an extra one to go home with. I haven't had any issues with tearing with my other pregnancies. Thank God for that. Um, maybe sometimes a little sore, but overall, um, just the cooling pad, which hazel pad, they definitely come in handy. So I wanted to have some extra ones and this box has a hundred in it. Also, I really, really wanted to try out the Honey Pot brand. I've heard so many really great things about it. So I was excited to just overall give these a go. And these are the postpartum herbal infused pads with wings. And it's plant-based, so that's super exciting. And there's 12 of these. I only got one package because I'm testing them out and seeing um, how I like them overall. Also for the downstairs area, I got a bunch of maxi pads. I know a lot of women like to use the adult diapers, um, but personally, I don't. I get a ton of different brands. I have the Equate brand, which is the Walmart brand one, but I also did get some of the Always brands as well. I already have those unwrapped and put away. I have some in the really large overnight pad as well. And then one and more like a medium because eventually things will relax down there. Since I will be breastfeeding again, um, there's a few things that I know I cannot live without. One, I would just nipple cream, which I already packed away into my hospital bag. I know usually the hospital does give you little tiny ones, but I wanted to make sure that I brought my tiny ones as well as my big tube because um, when I first start breastfeeding, I get really bad, just like blistered and chapped um, nipples. and. This time around, I want to try and apply down there before they get really bad because once they get really bad, it's so painful not only to nurse, but sometimes the pad sticks and it's just not fun. So, first and foremost, nursing pads. I got the Stay Dry nursing pads, the, Lans the Lansino brand. I like this brand and I also do like the Target brand. Also from the Lansino, I'm going to try the Sudi's cooling gel pads. I've never tried this before. This is supposed to provide instant relief for sore nipples. Um, it soothes them, heals them, and protects from rubbing and irritation. It comes with two pads. So I did get one of these. I read the reviews. Um, as pretty much anything, some are really great reviews, some are really, really bad. And some people said that they just straight up didn't work. But this time around, I'm willing to try anything, guys. Because when they become irritated, it's just not fun. And then last but not least, also from the Lansano, is the TheraPearl 3-in-1 Breast Therapy Packs. It's supposed to give relief for tender breasts. Um, you can use use it for like a cooling pad to relieve pain, swelling caused by engorgement. 
or you can use it as like a heated pad to relieve plugged um, ducts. Yeah, guys, that is everything that I got um, for postpartum. Everything else is completely just ripped open. It's just more pads for my breast and for my downstairs area. So nothing too exciting. If you're curious about the container that I'm going to use, it's just this really big white container with handles. This is from Ikea. I honestly can't remember how much it is because I bought this maybe last year sometime. Um, but this is what I plan on putting some of my postpartum stuff in. That way it's just all together in one area. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.